The Anaheim Ducks have made the postseason in each of the last five seasons, but the team is anything but satisfied with those results. We caught up with a few of the veterans ahead of the 2017-2018 season to find out where this team is at and where it's headed. What would you say are the strengths of this year's team? I mean, we have everything to be a really successful team. We just got to put the pieces together. Probably depth is the biggest thing. Uh, we added some pieces and we got guys back in our lineup. And we went deep last year and pretty much have the same team from uh, top to bottom. So that's probably our biggest advantage. I think we have four lines that can contribute and all score and then our, uh, our defense, uh, same thing. Probably the biggest strength would be uh, our defensive structure. I think just like we're tough to play against. We play hard every team and uh, it doesn't matter what they throw at us. And in your opinion, what would you say the biggest area of weakness or focus to improve on is? Um, consistency is always the biggest thing, I think, when, especially when you have a young, younger team. I mean, just staying consistent throughout the regular season and just being consistent every night and you know realizing that it's a process from tomorrow when we get on the ice for the first time to June when you know hopefully we would win the Stanley Cup. Try to maybe create more offense obviously that the league is getting a little more offensive minded. In the end uh, if you can score more than two plus goals a game you have a pretty good chance of winning. I think special teams we can be a lot better at. I think uh, our power play struggled a little bit last year, especially in the playoffs. What's it going to take to get back to the Stanley Cup? Things come up during the year that you have to, you know, cope with, and uh, you know, just get to roll the punches, and you know, hopefully everything comes to together at the end. A lot of work. We got to put the work in this year for sure. We got expectations this year. Um, everyone's expecting us to be around that time, so uh, we got to deal with those things in the right way. I think it's just. Uh, a matter of uh, small details uh, and some luck in the end too and uh, hopefully we can get uh, to that this season. I don't think there's anything systematically or anything different that we need to do. I just think we need a few things to go our way and hopefully we can uh, be there fighting for the Stanley Cup. How much of a chip on your guys' shoulder do you guys have in the last couple seasons? Like I said, the expectations have definitely gone up and uh, some guys have dealt with that before and some guys haven't so we're going to have to deal with that as a group. and. Uh, make sure that we're ready to handle it. Nothing is taken for granted in this league, but you know, I think we're we're all pretty determined to to get back to where we were and then even further. I think uh, the few additions we make, I think we're in the right track for sure. Well, it's a long year, but but the way we play and how physical we play, we're going to be we're going to be right back there. We believe that we can win and we're expected to win, so uh, we need to come in with that mentality right at the start of training camp. Now, if there's anything you want fans in Southern California to know about this year's Ducks team, what would it be? So we have a good chance. I mean, that's the, the biggest thing. Um, going into any season, if you have some expectations on your shoulders, it's, uh, it's an exciting time around the, the organization and the team, and we expect to play good hockey. It will be a physical team. Uh, we'll be fun to watch, uh, as usual. And We'd probably ask them to be uh, to be loud for us too. We're a strong, tough playing team. Uh, we play every team hard. We we we're fun to watch, I think, and uh, it's definitely a, a blast coming to one of our games and uh, enjoy the excitement. We understand um, as fans how tough it can be to have your your team be close but not quite there. And as players, we're frustrated too. But uh, you know, these are great fans, and they believe in us, and uh, they've always supported us. So. If they continue to do that, then uh, hopefully we'll be okay.